We'll figure it out. Oh yeah, okay, so, so we got all that stuff. Okay. So we can just follow on uh, in the missions, eh? I wonder if I can change the... um, Because I think this is like pavement, right? I wonder if I can change that. Okay, we're a, a solid 60 FPS, so that's that's good. Um, so I think a lot, a lot of the stuff that I fixed actually worked. Let's take this off. Oh yeah, we wish I should do this. Um, wait, something like what is it? Oh, I, I can't flatten. Oh, because I need special tools. Okay. Well then, I let's just get started then. Um, survive the landing on Silva. Okay, we did that. Insta unpack oxygenator, install oxygenator on the shelter, connect the printer power to shelter. Okay, I can do that. I can do that. It's pretty simple. We'll unpack everything. Boom. Connect. Yeah, so there's quite a few games here. I've uh, been making a game list. Um, there's actually a game expo. Uh, um being shown by one of the streamers that I, I watch as well. I don't know if we'll watch it because I think he, he allows us to like restream it. Uh, I might do that or I might do something um, after the fact. I guess we'll see. But um, lots of new games coming out that are very, very, very interesting from what I see. Very interesting. So not all is lost in the gaming world. Not everything is like Diablo Immortal. <laughs> uh, connect a tether. Uh, okay, okay, we can do that. Boom. We connect a tether to our backpack, and let's just uh, put one out here. Right, just one tether, so we can get some stuff here. Um, hmm. Like so. Wait, P is for tether. Okay, breathing space. That's done. What up, Claire? How's it going? Sorry? What are you sorry for? Um, okay, connect tether. Okay, now we got soil. Okay, does that mean I can, like, re redo this? Customs? Yeah. Well, it is what it is, right? It is what it is. Okay, yeah, can I flatten now? I can't. Uh, I should have expected that actually. It was silly of me not to realize that it would probably like. It was silly of me to assume that delivery dates are accurate and they actually send things on time. That would actually receive things on time. Did I hear about microplastics being found in Arctic snow? Yeah, not surprising. <laughs> Not surprising to me. Oh, oh but it was a uh, uh, Antarctic. It was an Arctic. But still, um, does not surprise me. Because uh, when I was when I was in the Arctic, um, oh, we need to gather these. When I was in the Arctic, there's uh, already some some residue. Everything goes goes up north because of the winds and stuff. So everything that we produce, everything that we put out, <laughs> it eventually makes its way up there. And sometimes the things from up there come down here, but it's, it's all connected. Okay. I think we need to get these. First time? No, it's, it's not the first time. It's uh, It's been going on for a while. It just maybe uh. Whatever news articles picked it up was like, oh, this is, you know. In a way, it's kind of like, it is a bit sensationalized because it's been going on for a while. Same thing with like the, the um, CFCs in the 70s, right? The, the hole in the ozone layer, right? Uh, before like the uh, the Montreal Protocol was put out that uh, kind of like banned many CFCs. Like the stuff that they use in fridges and stuff <laughs> until now. Uh, like that was going up north too. So it's, um, yeah, it's, 
it's a thing that eventually um will get fixed but it's gonna take a long time we're, we're gonna be dead before it gets fixed <laughs> i do believe in the future like we'll uh like we'll be able to fix all of our environmental problems or most of them but we're just not there yet it's kind of like how how developing countries um have to go in the same transition as as we did right they have to go through the same industrialization process as we did in order to get cleaner energy too okay. there is cause to worry but um there's cause to hope too <laughs> that's all i'm saying I think a lot will change with the uh, electric cars. It, it really will. Because higher, higher electric cars will create, um, well, less, less demand for oil. A lot less demand for oil. And even though emissions, like cars, are not like a huge thing for emissions, right? But it's all about the, uh, oh, oh god, we're full. We're completely full. Um, it's all about the, uh, how should I even put this? The more electric cars are on the road, the more the technology will progress as well, because there's a demand. And so we'll get lots more, um... A lot more efficiencies in all industries because of it. Now, it's almost like kind of like the the whole um, VR and gaming, right? Right now, virtual reality in video games are pretty. You know, it's I don't want to say it's non-existent because it's it is like a niche. Th yeah, it's it's niche. That's it. That's the word. It is a niche thing, right? So the technology isn't there for many games. But as it gets developed, more and more developers will jump in. It will be more efficient and better, etc. Same thing with electric cars and all the technologies that are derived from that. Good electrical energy sources. Um, yeah, e but even then. But so some of them, yes. <laughs> Wait, I didn't build more tethers. So there's, there's a lot of things here. So just to, to, to sum it up, I am... Um, it's definitely not new. Microplastics in the in the Antarctic here. Is it cause for concern? Yes. I I think it's it's not more like this. Is it cause for concern? Yes. Is it cause for alarm? Somewhat. And that's what what I would say. Even though I'm a very big environmentalist at heart, um, a lot of um media is sensationalized as well and this does not preclude um environmental stuff too yeah. but you know what drives clicks chat sensationalized stuff so that's that's why they do it the so cost for concern but not like the world is ending. Yeah, let's grab all this stuff. I think, yeah, I think it doesn't lag anymore. From what I see. Yeah, I, I somehow fix, temporarily fix something on my, on this PC until, uh, until. I get the new one. Yeah, Sir Cole, there's a whole thing about acid rain as well. <laughs> That's one thing that could be... Well, I guess it's not that as big of a deal now. But let's say if we kept using coal. Then it'd be a crazy huge deal. So I guess in some countries I still use coal, acid rain is still a... 
a pretty uh pretty crazy thing. Like I, I think you can like historically look at like um other uh Like articles and stuff in like I don't know what it is. Is it in the the sixties or seventies? About how like some buildings were like literally being I don't want to say deleted, but <laughs> definitely being uh, eroded here because of the acid rain. But this is even though we consume about a credit card worth of microplastics per week. Like most data is probably bullshit. Um, I don't know about like a, a credit card worth. Like we probably do consume microplastics uh, quite a bit because of the food chain. Um, there's been quite a few documentaries about like, for example, like um, the open up fish, right? Open up fish or birds, right? And we we consume fish and or birds, not not just chickens, right? And um, they open up their stomachs and there's tons of plastics inside, right? And so if if the animals eat plastics, then inevitably we probably do too. So that's that's why um That's why I guess you have to be careful where you consume things from. Like for example, if you I like for example, I love tuna. Right? I absolutely love tuna. I I, I if I could eat it every day, I would, but I can't of the high mercury content that tuna has <laughs> well or higher right uh so you just have to be careful what you eat and where you source it from etc sometimes it's hard to see where you source it from ideally you do like farming sim where you just grow your own stuff <laughs> Because then you know where the heck is coming from. Um, but yeah, it's all, it's all a balance of things. I mean, it is, it is getting better in many ways. Right, there's a lot more regulation now. But yeah, the the fishies consume anything they can, right? Who knows? Maybe, maybe uh, at some point, a lot of the things will be synthetic. <laughs> meat won't actually be real meat anymore. You know, they'll just be like uh, lab-grown meat. I, 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 uh, I would try lab-grown meat as long as it tastes good. Um, and it's like healthy, with that not anything like you know, no crap added into it. I try it because that that means all the stuff that the animal consumed well I wouldn't be consuming it too right just be growing in the lab hmm and I guess it depends maybe one day maybe one day But I would not be surprised if we did consume a tiny bit of a uh, plastics here. That's what I would like to have. You know, like how in video games you have like your your HUD, right? You got you gotta like uh, eat. It's time to eat because your hunger is low or whatever. It'd be cool to have like a, a biometric HUD where you know exactly what's going in your body and exactly like uh, how healthy you are, etc. Right, you you hook up your 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 Apple Watch or whatever it is, you know whatever the corporation is in the future, and you know exactly what's like what's up with your body. That'd be kind of sick. It would tell you like, hey, you need more vitamin C. You're running low. <laughs> That'd be cool. Uh, okay, medium storage, medium platform, oxygenator. Okay, we can do that. So I grabbed a bunch of resources. So now, now I should be good for a while. I'll do that. 
Boom. Very nice. Maybe. Maybe in the future. Or maybe in the future we'll have nothing at all. Who knows? <laughs> I, I, I guess I would say I'm more of a futurist. Very, very hopeful for the future here. I mean, we still got a long way to go. Another one. I only have two platforms here. Um, I guess I have this platform to store things. Same thing with the uh, hope for the future that, you know, we'll have less and less Diablo Immortals on our hands. You think you'll make a huge mess and all people will suffer and only then will we bother to do something about it? Nah, I think, um... Well, we are more of a reactionary species. But I think, uh... I think it's just a process. I think we'll, we'll, uh, we'll eventually get there. But I don't think it'll be like a huge mess. Um, or not as big as a mess as people make it out to be. A medium printer. Uh, yes, we'll make that. Make a medium printer. And I guess it depends on what kind of mess we mean. Okay, we have a medium printer. Um, medium platform A, no, medium platform B. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, I see. Um, I think I have to do this. Let's give it a try. Yeah, the thing is, I don't know. I'm always skeptical because the future is always so uncertain. Like, for example, if you told past Drek that we have a pandemic on our hands, like five years from now, I'd be like, you're freaking nuts. <laughs> That's never going to happen. You, you've been watching too many, uh, too many movies, you know? So who knows what will happen. But uh, I guess we'll see. Despite what we see on the news, things are getting better and better every day. But the good stuff is always born to, to... Doesn't generate clicks. So they never show the good stuff. <laughs> That's mostly why. Wait, can we turn this... Oh, I can't turn it around. Okay. There, there we go. Now we need a... Large platform B. Can I do that? Um, oh yeah, there's so many quests that I gotta do here. I totally forgot. Okay, land filling. Fill a small cancer of soil. Okay. So, we already got that. Uh, print medium printer. Okay, we already got that. Yeah, I gotta remember to pick these up. Because now we have we just got a big platform. Large platform B. Yeah, I'll, I'll just follow the quest here. Okay. Boom. Okay, okay. We've got a mini platform here. Man, I was really hoping I would get my new PC today. I was super... Oh, or yesterday. I was super excited. I got everything almost all ready. Well, like halfway, halfway um, of the day yesterday. And I was like, it's not coming, so... Because I was, I'm, I think I'm going to remove my shelf or something. I want to, like, change some part of the setup. I did half of my room, and then I was like, you know what? <laughs> it's not coming. Uh, allow creating an attached boost mod to train tool. Okay. Boost mod to train tool. We can do that. Boost mod to train tool. Any team when, when it'll be out of customs? No. It's, it's uh, kind of like a black box in there. It just says, uh, 
I, I emailed them and said like, hey, is, is it stuck? Do I need to like pay anything? Because I'm assuming I might have to like pay tax or whatever. So I'm bringing it, bring it in from the States. That's, that's what I'm assuming. I was like, do I need to pay anything? They were just like, no, nope, you just gotta wait. I'm like, okay. I'm assuming there's probably a huge backlog. What, oh. B? No. Tab. Is it tab? I thought I had a UI or something. No, maybe not. Maybe not. Um. Okay, I have that. I need a power thing. Tether. Packager. Leveling block. Okay. I need like a power thing. Boost mod. Okay. A drill mod. I need a thousand bytes. How do I get a thousand bytes? Oh, maybe I need to research something. For science. Print and reuse the research chamber. Ah. Um. But. Can I. Can I print that? I don't know if it's like now. Uh. Research chamber. Nope. Research chamber. Resin and compound. Oh, I can do that. Usually big shipping companies have an expedited. Uh, shipping pro customs process yeah but um it's uh yeah usually <laughs> i feel things have changed a lot now probably uh, the, the the more pricey something is right because the computer is pretty pricey uh probably the longer it takes that's what i'm assuming and I'm, pro I'm assuming there's probably a huge backlog. That's what I'm, I'm assuming. What up, uh... Rutando? Um, you came to help me play the game? Do you have any questions? Uh, I do not have any questions at this time. Uh, but thank you for asking. So far, we're doing pretty good. We're doing a research chamber. We're, we're doing pretty well so far. We're following the quest line. Uh, we need to do... But how are you doing today? Okay, these are track. I'm trying to connect a small generator to power network. Ooh. Oh, wait. Do, do I have a small generator? I guess we will eventually. Nice and distance. Discover gateway chamber. Okay. Well, I can do that. There I go. Uh, I'm tracking all these things. A gateway chamber, eh? So, if I track... So, I guess the gateway chamber would be right here. Because in, in our, in our uh, previous attempt before, you know... <laughs> it was super scuffed and laggy. We found a, uh, a, 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 uh, one of those chambers. It's not usually about valuable goods so, so much as if the paperwork and labels are all clear. Well, hopefully they're all clear. Hopefully they are. I guess the only, the only thing I can do is wait. Although waiting is the long is the hardest thing. I, I do not like waiting for things, but that's uh that's the problem of our generation. <laughs> uh, oh well, yeah, I guess the millennial, millennial generation, waiting. We want instant, uh, instant things. Launch platform B. Why didn't I go with a company in Canada? Because they didn't have, uh, the things I wanted. They didn't have any, uh, 3080s. And to be honest, some of the companies in Canada don't really produce, I don't know. In terms of reviews, they're not like that great. Large platform below like that. So sometimes, you know, because I, I was like, okay, do I want to go cheap here? Right? Or do I want something that won't give me any headaches? And I was like, you know what? I'm going to get a PC. <laughs> like, like I've been playing with the PC issues. PC and sound issues and all that stuff for like ages. And I was like, you know what? I don't want any of that anymore. 
Like I want it to finally be over. So I can I can get on my streaming stuff and, and focus some energies on, on on this stuff. Okay. I bought a PC. No, I need a PC. I can't do all uh, any of the things that I want with uh, anything else. I need a okay, find and use research samples. Two out of three. Wait, can I go down here? Am I gonna slip in? No. You're good here then. This is a kind of a cave network. Kind of. I guess I can kind of go come down here. So what I can do is do something like this. Um, get, get my thing out and boom. Why'd you throw out your old clothes that you like? Like it was an accident or something? Uh, let's see here. Oh, I can't do that. Okay, I see. Nice. So we're gonna go deeper. We must go deeper. Oh, but I need another soil canister. Okay, before we go down here, I kind of want to go um and go out here. Oh, there's a wreck here. Let's go get that. I see something. Is it a battery? Power cells. Oh, but it's a crappy power cell. Okay. Okay. Crap. Okay. Then we saw saw salvage. <laughs> I saw stuff I don't need. Yeah, I guess, uh, well, you know, the, the best thing you can do now is just, uh, I guess this gives you an excuse to buy new stuff. You know, you have the perfect ex excuse now. <laughs> if things are broken, you know, you can just buy new stuff. Assuming you can afford, of course. Uh, I, oh yeah, I remember. The, this thing. Wait, did that, that, did that just appear? It almost seemed like it did. Okay. More than memories? Oh, I see. Well, I guess if, if that's the case, then you can just... You didn't need to throw it out if it was just, like, broken, right? Just still keep it for memory's sake. Um, okay, large platform B. We'll do that. Okay, we're getting there. Uh, okay, link that up. So, I wonder if I can do this. We need a drill mod. Um, dynamite. Yeah, we'll just do a drill mod. Did we, uh, oh yeah, we can do this too. Oxygen filter. Uh, beacon, work light, bo boost mod. And that's what we need. And boost mod requires... Z oh, yeah. So we need to go down. We actually have to go down. Okay. Let's take these compounds. Can I lock this into place? I can't. We'll make some... We'll put away this resin. We'll make some tethers. And we'll see. Oh, you're just sad about it? Oh. Well, you know. There's, uh... I guess it... it I, don't, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Sorry. Well, hopefully you feel better. Hopefully you feel better. Um, 
Um, hmm. I wonder if we can go all the way down here. No, that's the wrong tool. Okay, can we go diagonally like we did with everything? Because if I can, I want to bring my vehicle here. Oh, that, that doesn't work. And the cave system is right there, eh? Ah. Okay, but how do I... There we go. This, the, the tool is a bit uh, odd to use. Uh-oh. Okay, now what? Great, I'm gonna die. Can I, can I go up here? I can, I can. Okay. Nice. Okay. So now all we're gonna do is make sure that we have. A proper walkway. With the actual tethers. There we go. There we go. So now this works. And now we're actually down here. Okay. But we kind of like slide, eh? I guess that'd be a bit easier. We can slide down. Okay. So I guess there's a lot of research samples that we needed. Or that we still need. Let's just see if, um... We can find anything of note here. Did that hurt me? Uh, um, my character's red. Maybe, maybe. It's a hazard. So I guess you gotta watch out. <laughs> okay. Let's bring this up. Let's bring this up. We'll be able to scan this and then we can finally get what we need. Uh, that's not the way, although I do want that resin. Which actually, hmm. Hmm. We drop this thing. We can get a buttload of resin here. Because we need it. We need all the resin. Now that we got all the, uh, all this stuff. We should be able to scan. Just enough bites. To be able to, uh. To get the materials we need here. 
Is there anything can like a boost mod or something? I'll grab that. Yeah. In your mission, master of unboxing. So you know when you actually know what to do here. It's uh, not bad. We go pretty fast. Speed run. Astroner speed run. Uh, drill mod. Drill mod one. Nice. So now we're gonna build both. I need. I need. Um. I think I need zinc and some other stuff. We can put, just put that aside here. Uh, auction filters. I need uh, a boost mod requires some zinc. Um, a drill mod requires some ceramic. Okay. So I need zinc and or ceramic. But can't I make like a centrifuge to do all these things? Cable rewards. Okay. And tethers. Oh, nice. So then we've got a lot of stuff. All the tethers and we've got the other beacons. I could just stick a beacon here, and that's perfect. Stick a beacon on my base. And all the tethers now allows me to go underground and just find all the stuff that I need. Do I need all these tethers? Probably not. But we can we will need them eventually. I heard that like having a bunch of like tethers kind of like lags can lag your game here. Uh if you put plop down too many. <laughs> but we'll see if that lowers our FPS at all. At some point. Oh, I'll just grab this. I guess we can always remove tethers too. Um hmm. Oh yeah, we can save our game. Because you know we start a new save here. Enter. Exit. Okay. So We need uh, what, what are the quests we need here? Examine Melting unlock the print the smelting furnace, uh, refined aluminum from ladder, right? Okay, so we need a smelting furnace, say. Um I think I can make that in the medium printer. Smelting furnace. Uh maybe, maybe we'll see. Smelting furnace. Oh, but I need to unlock it. Uh I think that's on our arm. Storage canister, extenders, melting furnace. New platform, large shredder. Uh, buggy, okay. We, solar ray, no, that's like the big, big stuff. And it can't be the small printer, can it? Dynamite, little mod 2, wide mod, no power cells, no. Um, that's not it. Power sensor, source sensor, battery sensor, button repeater, proximity repeater. Those are just repeaters, extenders, power switch, splitters. No generator. Oh, yeah, we have to make a generator, don't we? Okay, we'll have to build that as well. We need platform C, okay. Medium storage silo, tile storage, medium multi purpose storage module, connection to a stable platform recommended ceramic. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can make a tractor and stuff, eh? Um, we're, we're gonna have to research that. Paver? Oh yeah, we can, we can pave stuff. Oh. I didn't know that. Okay. Maybe I'll smelt it for a circle. We can unlock that. But that's an, um... That's a large printer. So do we even have a large printer? We've gotta, we've gotta build more. Large printer. Okay. I need three compounds, which we do have. Okay, one. Uh, actually, maybe we don't. But we do. Great. We just barely have enough. Okay. And large printer. So, all the printers. Um, I do want to grab more compound. And I think there's um, probably some stuff underground I want to grab too. Oh, wait. It's perfect. If the research is done, I can put this into. Perfect. There I go. 
Uh, oh yeah, and also, um, can I make a small generator? I can. I guess that's gonna take a compounding. Hmm. Yeah, well, let's go. Let's go hunt for some compounds. I think I can get compounds like um out in the world. Or in that cave system that I was in. One or the other. Because I guess I, I did get a lot of compounds, but I guess that wasn't enough. Uh, let me see here. Oh, there's something here. Wait, I think that's a wind turbine. That's kind of sick. So we'll grab that. I guess another power cell, but I don't really need that. We'll grab that though. Ideally, I would have like that that tractor that I had before, but uh, I guess we're not there yet. We'll gather pretty pretty quick. I think I think I can get back to where I was, like today. Like now that I know exactly what I'm doing, uh, I don't think it'll take that long to to figure things out here. Now that I have like a, a focus. And triple strike taught me a lot of things. Uh, I, I think uh, I think we'll be good. We do need another platform for this though, because we'll just take this here for now. Oh yeah, I guess I could have uh, I could take this on my research chamber as well. Hmm. Where are the compounds be? Maybe quite a few. I mean, ideally, I'll probably need like the ceramic and stuff. Hmm. Where's the thing with the tractor? I, I guess I'll need that quest first. Never mind. Uh, I'm getting too far ahead here. <laughs> uh, yeah, because I need um. I was like, why not just get a tractor and then get all the stuff on on the ground, like all over the place. But I guess uh, I won't be able to build a tractor anyways. Not yet. Ooh, I spy with my little eye some compound. Very, very little compound, but some nonetheless. That's all resin here. Wait, where is it? Gotta be here somewhere. And some research, research samples. Oh, I found something. I guess I know how to space things out now. When it, whenever it just disconnects, we can just place another tether. I mean, placing tethers are way too close together. I see some compounds over there too. Yeah. We, we found one. We found a thing. We gotta figure out what the heck that is. I think these are like teleporters, like to go from one place to the planet to the other. But I'm not hump sure. Okay.
There it is. We'll grab this tether. Boom. There we go. So nice. We got a quite a bit of compounds, and we still need more. <laughs> but actually, once we have like the centrifuge, I could just make more compounds with dirt, right? That'd be quite nice. I think I can make it soon too. Gonna have to get more more dirts here. Okay. So I don't know. What, I I guess I gotta plug that in over there. Gotta figure out some things here. Okay. Can I? No, I can't. Not so to like, can I just go straight? Maybe I can. Let's just check it out and see. Because I might find some things in between here. And my base. My base is kind of relatively close. I think my oxygen can last that long. Yeah, I don't see anything in the middle. Okay. So at least we check. Oh. Let's check that. Yeah, but we need a, like a truck or something. We definitely need it. We need all the trucks. Hmm. Okay. Um, okay, so we got that done. Yeah, large printer. So we can print that. Now we've got all the printers. Um... For the most part, but we need to extend. Ideally, I would like to have all the printers on the side here or something. Oh, yeah, let's do that. Like this. Like so. Um, hmm. I wish I could move this, but whatever. Yeah, okay, we have a lot of soil to grab too. So, yeah, let's connect all these printers. Just so, so they can all be in like one place. Have some, some organization here. Okay. I think the big one, just place it over here. We're very powerful. We can move things around at will. Yep. There we go. Uh, yeah, large printer, shelter. Okay, uh, I guess that's all we can make with this. Mm -hmm. uh, so what is my next quest here? There was a few quests that I had to do. Something to do with compounds as well. Uh, okay, we can collect some bikes. Very nice. Take a bite. There we go, we got that. Uh, medium, unlock and print in the smelting furnace. Okay, smelting furnace. That's what we need to build next. I think they require compounds. But I don't know. Um, ah, resin and compounds. Okay, so I do have a lot of resin. I'll put this in here. Ah. Yeah, see these, these ones that are down here. Okay, print. Uh, but we'll print things. Uh, right here. Right on the side. That way it'll actually be printed. More respectable here. We'll do that. We'll put that on. Because actually my inventory is full. The smelting furnace. There we go. Oh yeah, there's a lot of things that I gotta get rid of here. Like the, all, all the green stuff. And we can use these for our generator. And the, these batteries here, um, they will disappear at some point. Let's do that. The optional power. Um, yeah, and I gotta get more tethers, eh? Which we have here. Okay, all the tethers. Perfect. 
So as we are making that, um, let us go get. Yeah, let's put away some cop pads here. Let's get um other resources. I think I can get like zinc and stuff. Um, let's do that real quick. Let's do that real, real quick, quick. Okay, so at least we unlock that. Wait, can we unlock things um, remotely here? I don't think I can. I have to go back to like, the mission control. Okay, that's a bit sketchy. We're going to have to sw uh, make uh, some changes to that that uh that slide here I, I guess sliding down is kind of nice but you think gonna have to change that go down let's go deeper uh oh um i mean sure We can do that. Some other stuff here too. Let's try and figure this out. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Uh, well, almost perfect. Okay. It's kind of cool that you can modify the ground though. And we'll just go down. Uh, I think that's too steep. You actually have to do like an angle for certain things. I don't like that. That'll work. Uh, kind of. Yeah, that's, that's too much. Uh, I mean, I can still get up, but it's a bit uh, a bit more difficult here. If we just like make it a bit more rough, rough around the edges here. Some grooves. Yeah, there we go. Kind of a bit better. <laughs> not, not the best, but a bit better. Uh, at least I got. Okay, I got this. Now let's see if we can find any um any like other soils and stuff. Ah, uh, there we go. Uh, I think this is glass. Maybe we can grab some glass. Why not? Wait, so let's go down here. But I don't see. Oh, I see. I do see some things. Oh, I forgot to bring compounds for my uh, generator. Ah, uh, that's what I needed. Okay, I knew I forgot something. That's. A, we'll, we'll come back. So, a bridge here. Well, now that I know how the tool works, it's kind of nice, in some ways. Now that I know how it works. Okay. I have to grab that too. Okay, there's two things. To, there's three things to grab. Uh, what are these? Oh, there's compounds here too. Perfect. Okay. We have one compound. Um, okay. Small generator. Oh, but I need organics. Okay. <laughs> we'll rip. Uh, there are some organics. That could work. There we go. Oh, we need to turn this off. There we go. So now I can uh, uh, blow the top of uh, these things. 
Uh, at least we can get some stuff here. Very nice. Very, very nice. Hmm. Exodanox Research Aid. Oh, is it actually doing something? I don't think it is. I don't think it is enough power. I don't think there's enough power for this one. Okay. Well then. Oh, but I see more minerals. Hmm. We require more minerals. Okay, we can uh, dig these out. The pop corals. Can dig this out. Okay, maybe this generator will work. I don't know if it will. It seems like these things up uh, down here are, are require more energy. I guess maybe the deeper you go, the more they it requires. Oh no, okay. I think you need to hear the beeps. More like that. Uh, it pops off here. Okay. Got a research sample. So let's take that. Let's grab that. Boom. Um, yeah, there's quite a few things here that I can grab. I'm gonna have to watch out here. I think we found the metal lord of things to, to get. Uh oh, no more tethers? Well, that's not good. <laughs> we'll just put that down. That's, that's, there's that. I didn't see any other um, compounds that I can grab, so I guess we'll just have to do a bit of back and forth here. What's in here? More research samples, which is perfect. Now let's grab all this stuff. It's quite a bit of stuff. Is this a uh, a medium generator? It is. So carbon. Okay. And debris. I mean, a medium generator could be cool, but I don't know if I want want to keep that. Uh-oh. <laughs> Oxygen decreasing. Yeah, we need to find a compound. We can uh, make more tethers here. I guess we can go back to the base and, and find and get more uh, tethers. I just wanted to grab uh, all these, all the laterite, or or at least as much laterite as I could. I don't see any more though. Yeah, it's kind of nice. Yeah, we need we definitely need a centrifuge. One hundred percent. Oh no, that's a uh, that's um glass. I thought it was like compounds. Yeah, and these. I don't know what that was. Oh, compounds. I think it was those those pop corals actually like pop. Or something. Um beacons, work light, boost mod, drill mod, small printer, tethers. We'll make them tethers. Very nice. Now we can probably get more, grab more compounds because we need it. We need more. That's quite a bit. Okay. Uh, we're kind of full. Are we? Hmm. I feel, I feel like we are. Uh, getting there. Yeah. Uh, almost. So what would this be? 
Oh, I think that's glass. Quartz. Okay. Wanna just grab this bad boy? There we go. Now, now we're maxed out. <laughs> we're capped. Uh, we just need to go back. Max out completely. Hmm. Oh, okay. Now we're still good. Uh, where do we go? I think my base is this way. Actually, you know what? We can check our compass, can't I? Oh, it's this way. Well, thankfully, we checked it. It's kind of cool that there's a compass. I wish there was like um, an actual like HUD for the compass, like instead of like, putting it like that, because I feel like the uh, the compass blocks a lot of your view here. Like I wish it was like maybe like right right here or something, like in the, in the corner, like if you bring it up, so it doesn't like completely obscure your view. But I guess it is, but it is. <laughs> For now. Uh, I don't know if they do any more updates with this game or not. Okay. Uh, well, we did build that, eh? We built a smelting furnace. So, what we need is more platforms. Uh, but I think more platforms is in this, uh, this thing, eh? Large platform B. So, I need three resin. I can put away all this stuff. Uh, I got some stuff here. They put them away. Got a lot of resin here. Got a lot of compounds. 